Utrecht, Sint Jacobstraat. Up to a year ago, really a street for motor traffic. But what a transformation. It is a people's place now. Buses dominated the street before. And while these buses are still there, they seem a lot less intrusive now. The former narrow on-street cycle lane in part of the street has been transformed into a wide separated cycle track that won't be so easily invaded as these old ones were. It is all very clean and clear. But for a part where a building is still under construction. Ever since the street was first created in the 1930s, it has been a building site. An entire working class neighborhood was torn down to create a main arterial. But in hindsight, tearing down a neighborhood just before World War II was not a great decision. The war stopped everything and the redevelopment took over 50 years. That is why you can see 1950s flats right next to those from the 1980s. Office blocks from the 1960s, the 1970s and then one from the turn of the century, already replacing the block that was first built here in the 1950s. That 1950s cycle track was modernized as well. But the best feature of the new street must be these stunning flower beds. Also appreciated by insects, they give the street a very colorful and friendly appearance. The infrastructure is easy to use by young and old. It is easy to ride with your child when you are walking with a cane, in your mobility scooter or pushing your husband's wheelchair. Crossing the much narrower roadway is very easy now. Also when you are visually impaired. It doesn't always go by the book. People are people and they will make mistakes. But the design makes sure that mistakes are not lethal. All in all, this street that was originally built for motor traffic has become very friendly to people, most of whom are cycling, which they can do in a very relaxed way.